So here we're wishing for another year, just like the last year, where the family has been safe and happy and we've been provided for and everything that we need. We are grateful for everything that we have, including each other. Happy with the simplicity of life. And we hope we can have next year and many other years like that, where life is good. So today we're going to take you to some of the celebrations for Loi Kratong. Loi Kratong is the water festival in Thailand, happens every year, where people are worshipping the goddess of water and thanking the goddess for bringing the water for the harvest. And it's a time of making wishes. Uh, making wish and then uh, like a pray that like something bad that can float to the river. So you want me to float down the river, La? <laughs> <laughs> I always make these jokes. So we're going to take you to the festivities now of Loi Kratong. If you ever come to live in Thailand, if you ever come visit, it's a nice time of year to come because the weather's great. It's not too hot, not too cold, not too rainy. And it's, um, it's a time of festival. It's a festival season. So everyone's having fun. There's lots of markets, there's lots of music. Uh, people go down to the river and they let go of what is called a Kratong, which is what we're going to show you now in this vlog the kratong is often made from banana leaf or something that floats and it's and it's released down the river so all the kids are here and excited as well so let's go like kratong guys this is it these are the kratongs guys made from banana leaf very delicate and flowers this one is biodegradable but they do have others that are not biodegradable and really bad for the um, for the water, for the river, make it smell bad. I think these are the worst. They're made from like a bread, some kind of bread or something, and they pollute the rivers and the water. But I won't be humdrum about it. Here's all the kids. And so this is the body of water at the center of a town near us that they're going to put the kratongs into. So this is a big celebration in Thailand. They make a big deal out of it. Here they are. Here's your picture taking station. So there's also a beauty contest tonight where the girls come from miles around and they dress in the traditional dress like this and they have a little beauty contest. Beautiful girls, but here's the most beautiful here. <laughs> she hates that. She hates when I do stuff like that. Let's see the dancing. There's the traditional dancing. Here's the stage. So this will have the Thai dancing, the beauty contest, and here are the judges stations for the beauty contest. These are the VIP tables for the contest. Now there's only one thing Damo actually cares about, about this festival. What's the one thing that you came for? Street food. <laughs> just the food. She just loves the food. So you can see this is the <laughs> traditional Thai dress here. Kids all dressed up, ready to dance. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> It's always a nice atmosphere. Loi Kratong. Special day for them. Nice for the kids. And it's nice that it's around Christmas time too. You're getting a double bubble, aren't you? Yeah, a bit of Loi Kratong. And you're getting, uh, you're getting Christmas as well. Presents have started arriving for the kids. Babe, what do you wish for for Loi Kratong? What do you wish? Hmm? What do you wish for for Loi Kratong? You've got to make a wish. I wish. Uh, like a song, I always say, uh, if anything bad, just float into the river. Float into the yeah, river. That's all. That, that's what I pray for. We got smoke, smoke breathing T Rexes. 
So on a special day like this, you get the kids whatever they want. Sushi, cake, treats, kanom. Kanom is snack in Thai. Kanom. Saigok. Saigok is sausage. Saigok is sausage in Thai. Sushi, Saigok. Maprao. Maprao is coconut in Thai, my prao. I always try and slip in a bit of Thai for you guys. What I know, I'm happy to share. Mirai bang hap. Oh. Always plentiful, guys. Abundance. Abundance. That's what I think about when I come to Thai markets. I think about the abundance of it all. Like I'm seeing the UK, not to get political, but where I'm from in Bolton, all the shops are boarded up. There's hardly any local markets left. It's not It's not a place of abundance, you know what I mean? It's McDonald's and Burger King's, the only thing still open. High streets are all shut down. But the Thai markets are places of abundance, the places of plenty. On the cheap too. Cheap snacks. No, you don't have to be, you don't have to be rich to enjoy a Thai market. You can come with 100 baht, a few, a few dollars, and you're gonna have a feast. It's just night and day in comparison to what's happened with the places I'm from. And I have been invited back to the UK next year to shoot a series of the death of the high street in the UK and just do a comparison with Thailand. And I may join a fellow YouTuber there to um, shoot that series. It's a little bit of an expensive expedition, but I think maybe worth it. And what are you wanting there? What food do you want? Something Thai? Something very sap. Sap. Sap, I mean spicy. spicy, tasty, and like a strong taste. What is the only boy, like a half kid, you know, but always like a Thai snack, Thai, Thai dessert, <laughs> like Thai traditional dessert, like that. Can I ask you something, Tess? Do you love your daddy and tell the truth? Yeah. Do you want a marshmallow on a stick? I don't want that leaves. <laughs> Dipped in chocolate. Dunked in ice. Now that's yummy. Uh, the event of like a tomb, they do in a full moon day, so people they come for the festival it's like a big festival in thailand it's a big festival in thailand and then uh, you know some place they do in the temple and then people in the village go to temple and then float uh, the kratong that made from banana leaf uh, into the river and then they pray uh, it's like uh, if you have a sad thing in your life they say this time of the year you can float into the into the river. I'm gonna have myself one of these chocolate marshmallows, guys. Even though I don't eat sugar, it's a special day. We'll call it an indulgence. Welcome, my cab. So this is my first time after many many years as well <laughs> that to see the big festival like this in you know uh, in the district, our district here. So I've dropped my resolution a little bit so you can pick up the night time a little bit better. If I shoot in 4K, I don't pick everything up. But I think this has got quite a nice light. You can kind of see what's going on here. Nice and bright. I'm having a picnic in the garden, she says. So I've been told that the parade is coming through now. This is the beauty parade. And you can see lots of flashing lights. So you've got the police here and some of the army people as well. Actually, Damo's uncle is a, an army general around this area. <laughs> got them all dancing here. And we got all the students here.
this is quite a modified truck here. Especially for the celebration. Quite a mod. joining in. I think some of these are from uh, Otis's school as well. We saw them practicing and preparing while we were picking up Otis from school. So all the students joining in in the traditional dress. But as you get progressively further back in the parade, things are getting a little bit more crazy. <laughs> So these are the Thai beauty queens. You'll notice Thai people super friendly, super inviting. <laughs> Always happy, not a miserable face in sight. And again, more beauty queens coming through. with this whole parade kudos to you that actually stuck with me all the way down here but look oh I thought I'd find the end that's not the end guys it just keeps going on and on like an endless well it's a parade it is an endless parade of beautiful Thai people celebrating Loi Katong So even the little ones are joining in. All in the back of the car. In the school school chairs. And then we got up here, cars are all lit up. And it just keeps going on guys. I mean it's just one after another. I thought I'd come to the end of it there, but. Hello! <laughs> it looks like each one of these is a school. <laughs> and there you go, it just keeps going on and on and on. And I can't see the end of it. It's just going to keep going and going and going. I'm sure I could walk you all night. But I think this, this parade has been going on for about 10 minutes now. <laughs>
ท่าไรครับสองร้อยค่ะสองร้อยค่ะนี่สวยทำเองเหรอครับทำเองค่ะอันนี้ก็สวยนะคะนั่นเป็นมือค่ะครับSo here we're wishing for another year, just like the last year, where the family has been safe and happy, and we've been provided for and everything that we need. We are grateful for everything that we have, including each other. Happy with the simplicity of life, and we hope we can have next year and many other years like that, where life is good. So we'll leave that vlog here, guys. Like a tongue. I've tried to upload this on the same night. It happened uh, to give people an idea of what happens on this festival in Thailand. It's always a fun, fun day. It's a fun day for the community. It's a nice day for the community getting together. And I uh, remember a lot of these people are working six days a week. Some are working seven days a week. They they don't have like day, days off, and a lot of them don't have weekends out like we do. You know, like they don't go out for the weekend and that kind of thing. It's a it's a whole different way of life, and so these special days where the, it's the holidays and everyone's getting together and having a drink and stuff, they really are important for them. They they are how they um, celebrate and relax. So I hope you've enjoyed the vlog. We're going to enjoy the rest of Loi Kratong, and now you know what Loi Kratong is. I shone bright and my journey was over What I sought when I ran Was back where I began No matter the rain No matter the storm I'm coming home I'm coming home Leave open the gate Don't turn off the light, I'm coming home with 
my claws and teeth So I elbowed my way to a seat There'd be no kind of peace like you beside me No matter the rain, no matter the storm I'm coming home, I'm coming home As it seems in the photo Nothing is as sweet going so long Nowhere I can ramble or Could change my mind Could slow 